And today, we're unboxing the new Troy Lee A3 helmet. Sounds like new product time. Actually, it kind of sounds broken. Better open this thing up. Now, I ordered this thing straight from the Troy Lee website. So this is how it comes from the manufacturer. Packing slip, don't need that. All right, thank you for your purchase. Awesome. All right, so there goes the initial box right there that it comes in with Troy Lee sticker pack. Set that to the side right now. You can see right there, they got like the foam in the top of the box. So your helmet's not gonna be destroyed when you get it. All the stuff about the MIPS on the outside of the box right there, if you feel so inclined to read it. Oh, and the brand new helmet. All right, we're gonna get back to that. I'm gonna go over the additional stuff that they got inside this box you can see all the foam lining right there to protect your helmet so it doesn't come damaged from the factory inside here let's see what we got a manual leave in the comments below have you ever actually read a helmet manual pretty thick right there i'm assuming most of it isn't in english we got more stickers helmet bag right there mesh bag for your helmet extra helmet liner awesome that's so cool that it comes with the extra helmet liner some extra little screws for the visor because that visor is meant to break off and some extra little velcro pieces for the helmet liner when you're installing that and this right here this is that new sweat system that they have right here so two extra pieces of that forehead sweat band right there and for bald guys like me especially if I'm riding down south like I was last summer. That is greatly appreciated. Now let's get to the helmet. And there it goes. What you guys all clicked on this video is see the Troy Lee A3 helmet. This one is in the solid black. So it's got that kind of glossy black there with the matte black on the top. Plenty of exhaust ports. I'm sorry, vent ports up front, huge exhaust ports in the back. So it should be able to give plenty of ventilation, even with that new helmet liner in there that has a lot more padding, which is supposed to make this thing super comfortable. That's kind of what they're selling on is that this is the helmet that you'll never have to take off. It has the cut lines in there, the kind of pre-designated cut lines in there in case you want to cut it to get a little bit better ventilation it's got the sweat piece up on the front that i kind of showed you earlier they give you an extra helmet liner and two extra sweat pieces so that's cool of them it's got the completely uh, upgraded adjustment right here on the side the fidlock buckle system and see how easy that thing just buckles right together for any of you guys that have ever had a fidlock buckle on your helmet it's kind of once you have it you don't want to go back away from it the fit um, i ordered this the same size that i had my a2 in yes i have a massive head is it extra large extra extra large that thing is comfortable right out of the box i remember my a2 when i put it on there was some spots where there was no padding and um it you could definitely feel it at first and after a while you just get used to it but this helmet is super comfortable the side pieces let's see how easy those are to adjust so you can get that thing adjusted pretty easy right to where you want it you know how important it is to get that helmet fitted kind of just right so those things aren't rubbing against you as you're riding it also has way deeper protection around the back and on the sides and around the temple so if you're somebody that rides a little bit more all mountain or even enduro-ish kind of trails on your trail bike that's much appreciated it's got the new updated retention system with the 
micro adjust right there. Gadgets, love them. It's got all the awesome information here on the tags for people that would like to read about how to protect it, what the Fidlock system is, what the MIPS system is. There it goes, the Troy Lee A3 helmet unboxing. If you guys like this video, go ahead and smash that like button. And please click on the next one if you guys are interested in seeing the A2 versus the A3 helmet. Also, like I spoke about earlier, this solid black, the reason why I got it that way, the same reason why I got this helmet in solid black, and then I added all these silver graphics on myself using vinyl wrap. Keep watching, get out there and ride, and remember you guys, have fun.